Good day YouTube. Today I'm doing just a bit of a quick review between uh, Linux Mint 21 on the left versus Elementary OS 6 on the right. Now Linux Mint is actually running on the XFCE desktop environment, whereas Elementary OS uses its uh, lovely little Pantheon uh, in-house built and customized desktop environment. So let's uh, have a look at this, the menus and things and see what's going on. Now we've got the applications menu for both of them. Uh, for instance now, uh, I believe that uh, Elementary OS is tightly integrated with the, the, uh, the GTK2 GNOME stack, the old version, because it looks like a GNOME to me, with a little bit of a Mac OS-esque uh, launcher bar down the bottom there. Uh, whereas uh, you could say that Linux Mint has a bit of a simpler design. You go to the applications menu, you search for what you want, and away you go. If we were to do a bit of a right click, we can see that um, we've got a few extra options on the Linux Mint side. So you can open the terminal, which is nice to see. Whereas it's not every day I want to change the, uh, the wallpaper or the display settings or even the system settings for elementary OS. So I'm a little bit let down by the fact that that's not given us many, many options. Uh, next up, we'll have a look at the uh, let's have a look at the file manager. Now, I know that on the left-hand side, Linux Mint, uh, which is with its beautifully customized green file manager, is using the Thunar file manager, uh, which is really in lockstep with uh, the the XFCE desktop environment. But when we go to the uh, Elementary OS file manager, which here we go, finally found it. <laughs> it's not as easy to use. Now, I actually don't know which one this is. Let's see if it gives us any advice. Mara, that's actually not right, Gala. So it's, um, it may be Thunar as well, but customized there too. I wish I could actually see more options. In fact, elementary OS is said to be quite popular, but I can't really do a lot with it. I'm a little bit upset by that. Okay, next up, let's have a look under the hood, see what's going on there. So, they are actually both built on the long-term service release of Ubuntu, uh, which just came out in April. So they're both running on the same uh, latest and greatest kernel, or one of the latest and greatest at least. And last but not least, uh, take these values with a bit of a grain of salt, but the CPU and RAM usage on boot up. Now, uh, we are idling off for both of them there, so that's nice to see. Linux is currently on 590 megabytes of RAM, and uh, elementary is on 741 megabytes of RAM. So about 150 megabytes more of RAM for elementary over Linux Mint. So always something to uh, just, just, just be aware of. So thanks for watching, guys. Please leave a comment, subscribe, hit that like button. And I do hope to see all of you guys there in the next one. Ciao.